Welcome to Willand. It's a village in Mid-Devon which is on the rise, quite literally. Experts say it could be rising from beneath our feet by up to two centimetres a year, and it's baffling them as to the reason why. Take a look at this map from Geomatic Ventures showing the southwest. It shows deformation of the UK between October 2015 and October 2017. Each pixel represents the average vertical height change over a period of observations, with green being around the 0mm mark. Now, zoom in on Willand and it's blue, meaning an uplift of up to 8mm per year. Well, this morning I spoke to Andrew Souter at Geomatic Ventures to try and shed light on why Willand is rising. On this, on this map, I can see mining deformation, I can see peatlands deforming, I can see landfill, and 99% of everything on this map I can account for. Yeah. yeah? But that thing in Willand, <laughs> uh, I'll say, I can't. And it's important because it, it straddles the M5 and, and a major railway line yeah. as well. Um, so, first of all, what we did is we, we checked that it was real, that we hadn't screwed up. And um, what we did is we looked at different satellite passes as a sort of independent thing. And yes, it's real. So yep. it's definitely rising at a maximum of around about two centimetres per year. So we know it's there. So the next thing I did was I, I called up the British Geological Survey and said, you know, is there any history of mining or anything like that in the area? Uh, they didn't think there was. They didn't see anything... Um, sort of weird about Willand. I mean, Willand is, is you know, miles away from any mining centres or yep. former mining centres in Cornwall or Devon. So um, there's, nothing, there's nothing that could explain that. Um, and the next thing I did was I contacted the Environment Agency, and it's with the Environment Agency at the moment. I think they are, they're looking, looking into it, but they've not, not been back to me. Two centimetres a year may not seem that much, but it could have an effect on our region's roads and our railways. The rate is still very low at two centimetres a year. I really wouldn't expect... It, it might have an impact on the... They might have noticed something on the railway lines. Right. Yeah, because what's, if, you're, if you're standing still and the whole village comes up at two centimetres a year, you're not going to notice it. No. But if, you, if you're running a high-speed rail over that then you might notice that oh i've got to you know i've got to maintain this bit of rail a bit more often yeah because okay. you know they are looking for things like that on railway lines well i've been walking around willen now for the best part of an hour and to be honest i haven't felt a thing but that doesn't mean the locals haven't felt the ground rise beneath their feet so let's go and find out if they've noticed it no certainly not what you wouldn't notice that much would you Apparently not, but I'm just wondering. Yeah, too small an amount. Too small amount. I don't know. No, that's nothing I know of. It's absolutely weird, isn't it? It's got to be water, isn't it? I think water. There's no volcanic action around here, so I'd, I'd have thought it was water-based. But normally it's like mines, isn't it? Mines that fill up with water or shafts or something. But I don't know of anything around here. But it's bizarre, isn't it? Absolutely not felt bizarre. the effects, have you? No, not at all. No, the air is just as, just as good, just as thick, just as breathable. But no, not really. No. I haven't really like felt anything to be fair. I don't think I would. I I find it mildly interesting, to be honest. And uh, but I've not noticed any difference. I, I feel just the same height as I've always been. <laughs> well. You know, it's not enough to notice, is it? Two centimetres. Nothing at all? No. No I, no ground tremors? No, I've got no ideas what um, what it would affect. Not a lot, I wouldn't think. The case of Willand is continuing to baffle the experts. So it'll remain a mystery of exactly what's happening here in the village. Lewis Clark, Devon Live, in Willand. <laughs>